Hey, take a bow. There you are. What's starting to think that you had in your little cabin all day? What, you too embarrassed to see me after yesterday or something? I mean, not to brag, but I am a pretty good kick. Ah! Ow! Jeez, Tank! No need to be punching me in the ribs like that. Not like anyone's around to hear me anyway. Yeah, you're the last to get here. The others have already started that trail quite a while ago. Of course I waited! I came up with an excuse and everything. There's no way I'm letting you walk around by yourself. What, I wouldn't want you to run into any of those idiots. If they've noticed that your stuff is gone, they're pissed for sure. Nah, not taking that risk. If they want to mess with someone, it better be me. At least I know how to handle a fight. But, you know, while we're here, all alone, no one around, the old campsite to ourselves. You want another taste, shorty? Ow! Fuck! Got it! Got it! Not here, then. <laughs> Aww. Look who's blushing all over. Not gonna lie. It kinda suits you. Getting flustered by the memories. The heavy rain. Standing so close to me to fit under that umbrella. Feeling my warm skin against yours in the cold wind as you leaned against my chest. Thinking about it now, you're probably the romance inside, huh? Well, too bad you almost landed face first in mud right after. <laughs> sorry, sorry. I promise not to mention it. I know. Your shocked face is just too funny, though. You should be glad I caught you, short stuff. If I'm your personal bodyguard for much longer, maybe I should start charging a fee. <laughs> Seriously, though, I think we should get started on this hiking thing. You really took your sweet time. I think they're taking attendance at the end or something. I don't know. I only half listened, to be honest. I don't really feel like walking this entire trail. That's like, what, three fucking hours? And all just because they want us to walk around this big-ass lake? Nah, shorty. We're taking a shortcut. I'm serious. Look, it's not like we're gonna go off the path. We're just gonna take a different one. Come on. You know I won't change my mind on this. Let's get going already. I didn't disappoint last time, did I? I led you back to your cabin, perfectly on time for curfew, despite the rain and all. I told you my navigation skills are top-notch. My dad used to take me hiking all the time. I know how to memorize directions pretty well. Though I got it in then, I gladly missed curfew in exchange for making out some more. <laughs> joking, joking. I know you're not the type to be late and break rules. I bet you wouldn't know what to do if you ever got in the slightest trouble with teachers. I swear this totally isn't my fault. Rez dragged me into it. He's such a mean. <laughs> Nah, Tank, that is exactly what you sound like, I promise. Damn, why are you trying to push me, nerd? Just so you know, barely felt the thing. You're so small, it's like a fly trying to hit me. Okay, okay, I get it. I might start pushing you if you don't quit acting like a brat. <laughs> oh, you don't believe me? Here, watch. <laughs> Didn't expect that actually do it, huh? Well, lucky for you, I went easy on you. You see these arms, short stuff? I could pick you up no problem and throw you right into the lake if I wanted to. You should be glad I'm so nice. <laughs> Ouch. Hey, no need to push so hard all of a sudden. You want to fight? Because I let you know right now, you don't stand a chance. Right, right. Of course you'd beat my ass. No problem. Well, let's see about that then. Nah, I'm serious. Come on. Show me your best punch, Tank. Seriously? What was that? You scared you hurt me or something? Come on, show stuff. I'm not that fragile. Just do it properly. 
I mean, why not? If anything, it might help you against Tyler if I'm not around, so might as well, right? Not that I don't want to help you, but let's just say my attendance doesn't really measure up to yours. But you said you want to fight, so let's do it! I promise, I'll hold back, like, 99.9% .9 of my power. <laughs> no shit, shorty! I kind of noticed that you've got no clue what you're doing. <sighs> alright, alright. Let me give you a couple points then. First of all, you're standing all wrong. If your opponent won't knock you over, the wind will, okay? Let's fix that. Put your right leg back a bit, like this. Looking better already. But, uh, do me a favor, Shorty. When you make a fist, do it like this instead, okay? Keep your thumb out, don't tuck it in. I don't want you to break all your fingers. That usually ends a fight pretty quickly, and not in your favor. And then you swing like this. <sighs> Got it? Okay. Now, hold your arms up like this. A little bit higher. You want to be able to block my punches. <sighs> I already told you I'm not going to actually hit you. Who do you think I am? Anyway, try again. And put some force behind it this time. Hell yeah, short stuff. Now we're getting somewhere. Do it again. Come on. That's what I'm talking about. You're better than I thought, actually. <laughs> I'm serious, Think. You're not totally horrible at this. With some practice, you might even be good at it. Not that you're ever gonna be better than me, obviously. <laughs> Don't even try. Ouch! Jesus! We teaching you how to throw a punch was a mistake. If I'm all bruised up by the end of this trip, you're the one that gets to explain to my dad. He'll think I started a fight again. Oh, and, uh, by the way. Ha! <laughs> gotcha. See? I still got it. <laughs> Why are you backing away like that? Did I hit you too hard? Hey, watch out! There's a... You okay, Tank? That looked... painful. Shit, did you cut your leg on that rock? It's bleeding a bit. Hey, don't freak out. It's okay. It's okay. Can I take a look? I'll be careful. I promise. Alright, hold on. <sighs> Doesn't look too bad. Thank God. It'll be fine. Fuck. Shorty, I'm so sorry. Seriously. I didn't mean for you to trip like that. I Did I hit you too hard? Or like, I swear, I was just playing. I, I don't know. Startled? Huh? I assume Tal has done that to you before then. Or one of his friends? I'm, I'm sorry, Dick Bell. I didn't mean to bring back bad memories. I was just... Try my best to forget about those fucking idiots for the day, actually. No, for real. I feel bad about it. I didn't mean to scare you. I'll make it up to you, okay? Not sure how, but I'll come up with something. I could carry up books for you, or like, buy you lunch or whatever. N no, not like a date. I mean, I mean, not that I don't want to, but I won't have asked that right now. Asking someone out should be all romantic and shit, right? I can't just ask that right after you fell on your ass. It has to be under a nice cherry tree or at the stream, maybe. But anyway, that's not even important right now. What's important is that you feel all right, Tank. Hey, I don't have a soft side at all. I'm just being sincere for once, and this is how you reward me. Questioning my personality? <sighs> Alright, I see how it is. Couldn't have hurt that badly then, if you're giving me attitude already. Glad to see you're not mad at me though. Do you think you could do the rest of the trail? I'm honestly tempted to just turn around and go straight back to camp. I bet if we show the teachers your horrific injuries and maybe you play up the limp a bit, 
we could get away with just chilling for the rest of the day. God damn it, Tank. Even when you've got a prime excuse to skip a boring ass hike, you still want to do it? Come on, tell me. What are you scared of? If they'll believe anyone, it's you. <sighs> Whatever. We'll decide later. We got to wait for the bleeding to fully stop anyway, before we can keep walking. We don't want to make it worse by rushing it. Then again, I could just carry you. No, I'm serious. How about I just give you a little piggyback ride, huh? Will you take a look at the world from my perspective? A non-short point of view? <laughs> oh, come on, Tank, it'll be fun. No one's gonna see, and even if they do, what's wrong with that? You're hurt. I might be an ass, but even if I wouldn't leave someone sitting in the dirt. It's only good manners, really. Believe it or not, I can carry you no problem. Can't win as many fights as I do without working out. <laughs> Did that convince you? Hell yeah, let's do this. I'll help you get up. Hop on, shorty. Ready when you are. Mm, there we go. Don't be shy. Put your arms around my neck. We don't want you to fall. <laughs> Alright. How does it feel being so far up? Pretty awesome, huh? Well, I'm glad you like it. Because it might take your mind off the fact that I just tricked you. Now that I picked you up, we're going wherever I want. And that means we're heading back to camp, baby. Nah, uh Not budging. Sorry, short stuff, but I've decided. So unless you want to walk the whole trail by yourself with a hurt leg, you'll have to act as my ticket to an afternoon off. Just enjoy the ride, Ticket Bell. 